The hurricane started playing at Sun Life Stadium seven years ago and average 60% of University of Miami students attend the first home football game of the season each year. The problem? An overwhelming amount of those students will head home on university buses through a program called U-Bus without even entering the stadium, but not passing up an afternoon of old-fashioned tailgating. Vice President for Student Affairs Pat Whiteley explains. Students were using the buses, uh, you know, student, more students were obviously traveling back. Everybody was going to pregame um, and, quite frankly, candidly, to party. To tackle the issue and get more canes in seats, Whiteley called for the assembly of a student task force. Amy Halpern was one of the students selected. Um, we kind of tried to look at the whole picture of the like, bus experience and what it's like to have our football stadium at Sun Life Stadium. Um, some of the suggestions were to adjust the timing of when the buses leave. The U bus is historically intended on shuttling students home beginning at halftime, but students would line up without penalty as early as kickoff. Brent Crank handles ticket operations and explains pushing the departure time later might encourage more students to stay at the game. I think that it would have worked. I don't know that it would have made a huge impact on overall attendance of how many students decided to come to the game, but I think it would have made a great impact on the impact that the student section could have on the game. Due to a depleting South Florida bus fleet, pushing the departure time was not feasible. The buses for the 2014 football season will still leave at halftime to avoid late arrivals back on campus. We have to think about the looping of the buses and using the buses for the second time. And I don't want to risk, and I think we all agreed to risk having students wait 90 minutes after a game. This year, a new student opt-in process will help the administration pinpoint the exact number of buses needed on game day. We, we put that in place to help them because the more accurate we can be, the better that we can serve them. We hope everybody will stay as long as possible to cheer on the Hurricanes, especially if it's a fourth quarter game. Student attendance, though, will always depend on student-athlete performance. And if student-athlete performance disappoints... I, I hope that that's not the case. I love Hurricane football. I've been watching it for 33 years, so I hope that's not the case at all. So right now, like Coach Golden, that's his, his job, and, and I have full faith in, in him and the team. And, uh, you know, all I want to make sure is that we have a great U-Bus program. For TMHTV, I'm Jordan Schumann.